If you're constantly sore and stiff between your workouts, then active recovery is what you need. And there's a million different gadgets out there specifically for active recovery. We know we've tried a ton of them. Massage gun, Theracane, massage ball, foam roller, the list goes on and on. Now, some of them can be good to hit specific areas of your body. And I do use these from time to time, but there is an easier and a cheaper way in order for you to feel better throughout your entire body and something that I use on a regular basis, and that is targeted movement. All right, quickly before I cover targeted movements, there are two things that I see people get wrong when it comes to active recovery. Number one, they overdo it. Probably don't need to spend 30 minutes every single day sitting in an ice bath, using that vibration plate, or rolling out your glutes. More doesn't necessarily mean better. Being specific and efficient does. Number two, they overcomplicate things. When you can make it easy to do the thing that you need to do, then you can stay consistent, and it doesn't get any simpler than using your own body weight. If you need ice every single day to fill up your bathtub or you need your massage gun or foam roller with you for everywhere you go when you're doing your training, it's gonna be tough to stick with it. Who the hell has time and the ability to fill up their bath every single day with ice? I know my wife wouldn't like that at all. All right, so let's talk targeted movement. You're just gonna use some light movements that's focusing on that part of your body that needs some recovery. That's it. Let's say that your legs are sore as shit after a heavy day of leg training. Well, move around in a squat and then do that until you start to feel that tension release. Could be 30 seconds, could be longer. But the important thing here is that you're being specific and active in using movement to help you with your recovery. Being specific and knowing exactly what to do with these movements is the fastest way to help you to recover and get you back to doing the activities that you enjoy doing in an efficient manner. By the way, we made an entire program to help you do exactly that called Regulator. Here's an example and something that you can use right now. For this movement, I wanna ask you to start in this 90-90 position. From here, you're going to let your arms slide and back and down onto the floor, your shoulders will touch, letting the arm come up over, knees drop to the opposite side, and then pulling the arm as you sit up into the opposite 90-90 position. So, hand slides out, rotates up over so that the arm is to the floor, knees come up over and fall, and you pull the arm in as you sit up out of that position. So that's it. If you do need assistance for this, feel free to use your hands by simply walking the hands back, lying down, coming to the opposite side. This hand now can go to the floor, helping you to sit up as you pull the hand close to you as you sit up into this 90-90 position, walking the hands out, up across, this hand now can help to assist you to sit up into this 90-90 position, gradually working on being able to go directly from the 90-90 to the 90-90. So if you wanna buy that new gadget that Instagram keeps advertising to you, hey, have at it, totally cool. Just remember though that it might not be the best thing for your entire body. That's where targeted movements come into play. And that's why movements like what we have in our program, GMB Mobility and Regulator are the best medicine for you. No ice required. Mm -hmm.